Hey everyone, it's Monday, and what a Monday it was at work. Anyway, so update time again. First of all, the rabbits. eventful past two days. Um, Storm had six babies on Thursday, Domino had five on Friday. Saturday night uh, we didn't have the storm as predicted but it did end up raining the whole night. A good drench. Yes. Uh, unfortunately Storm's nest got wet. We ended up losing all six. Domino didn't feed her babies. We could see from the beginning something was wrong. Um, she will be the next doe to be culled from the herd. I think she's a bit, we don't know how old she is, but I don't think she's interested in having babies anymore. And then yesterday, Ash had six. Again. Again, yeah. Exactly 29 days after the last litter. And then this morning when we got to the rabbit tree, Domino's litter was gone, as predicted. We did see it coming. And But Charcoal had her five. This so morning. this morning so um we are still on 11 babies we would have had 22 if not for the loss of the other two litters but uh, 11 is is all right we can deal with that i mean we're just starting and uh we're still learning much of what we're doing it's not like what i'm what i'm building i can make up as i go along um this is pretty much figuring it out as it happens so we are learning rapidly and um yeah off to the fish it's still a bit green but the fish don't seem too bothered by it i just saw some and they apparently saw me and hit again pump actually started clogging up so we put in well, we clean it up firstly and uh, I put in a pipe the pipe actually helps to increase the oxygen volume in the water and that should make them happier and grow faster secondly well thirdly for those counting <laughs> <laughs> um, the big pond that we had, or well, the big hole in the ground that's full of water, it's seeping away slowly, but slowly being the key word. Uh, let me show you quickly. This is still going strong, going nowhere slowly, and yeah. And then, fourthly, the raised bed at the workshop, the big one. This raised bed was battered by the actual rain the previous weekend and everything was moved around all the neat little rows were destroyed but they're still coming up everywhere the carrots are looking like grass yeah we thought that uh, all the the seeds spilled away with the previous storm that we had too two the Saturdays actual ago. storm yeah yeah uh, but everything started coming up again. It's just on different places now, but it's actually going quite well And then the grass raised bed that I built initially Yeah, there are a lot of plants coming up there now <laughs> Between yeah. the grass This raised bed kind of kept the neat little rows and That's actual grass coming up that I planted here long ago and uh, yeah, we've got plants. This side, more carrots. Right, that's onions. Onions. <laughs> I was told it's carrots, but anyway. This looks like grass too. That's a big onion. That's some onions. Beet. And something else. Cauliflower. Cauliflower. <laughs> Between the grass. And then the... Uh, potato tower. Potato tower. Tire potato tower is up to four rows of tires 
and it's going strong. Another Cobhouse fertilized uh, bunny potting soil mixture and it's amazing. We are on four rings now as predicted and still going strong. This tomato, yeah, these are going on. This is why my wife actually does the planting and stuff because it's so slow and tedious, nothing happens. It's just plants, they don't do much. And the uh, other things? Uh, yeah, the, the carrots and the lettuce and the cauliflower and the green peppers are all still going. I don't know what's happening with that particular lettuce. Um, the other lettuce are going good. Okay. Carrots. Carrots. Cauliflower. Cauliflower. Oh, don't know what's happening with them. Uh, not cauliflower, lettuce. Sorry. Lettuce. Lettuce. Cauliflower, green peppers. Okay. See? When she says the names, she actually sounds excited. Mm. If I say it, it's just like... Eh. Mm. More lettuce. Again, excited. It doesn't do much, it just sits there and... Mm. Mm. And that lettuce is going fine, but that and that pot just doesn't want to grow. The minute you give them water, then they all fall flat and then they die. So I'll probably just rip them out and plant something else in that pot. Okay, so that seems to be the end of our update. Also, just to add in there, the rabbit was delicious. If you missed it, go and check out our previous video. It's one of the previous two. Uh, barbecue rabbit, rabbit roast. Yes, rabbit roast. Uh, we also did the homemade marinade. Um, it was brilliant. All her idea. <laughs> and um, we will, we actually put the recipe at the bottom in the description, so just feel free to go and check it out. Um, and uh, other than that, uh, oh yes, I forgot about the, uh, what's that called? The gym squash and the tomatoes have been replanted. Okay, so we planted the tomatoes in big 25 liter buckets, 50 liters, 25 the buckets as well as the gem squash and gave them a spot to actually grow up and they look happy enough all right so that's all that's all been said and done i guess so now monday update complete and as always <laughs> have a good one